I'm Joe Wadzak and I'm Richard Siddle and we're stuck in a dark cave in Romania. Peace and help. Actually, <laughs> actually we're in Old Transylvania in Romania drinking some of the best valley wines in the world at Cremella Rakash. It's going to be a good day, Chief. <laughs> Cheers. Chief, so we have another classic wine here from uh, Cremel Rakas, the uh, part of their Zanziana range, which mm. is all about sort of single varieties. Yep. And this is a Merlot. Now, for all those Sideways fans out there. A good film, good film. Great film, Chief, but whenever you say Merlot, you immediately go, ooh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not so, much loved in America. I know, but, you, you know, what, what, what's the story behind Merlot? Okay, so Merlot, okay, Merlot, first of, all, first of all, in America, there was a lot of Merlot planted in the States because Merlot, when made in a slightly cynical, poor way, it's very easy to drink um, and it's very soft. It doesn't say anything. It's kind of like lift music for the mouth, right? Mm -hmm. um, now, Merlot itself comes from the French word la merle, which is French for blackbird, because it was always seen as a dark variety, which gave color to a wine. And in Bordeaux, the world's most famous wine region, there are two red wines that are king. There's Merlot and there's Cabernet Sauvignon. Now, Cabernet Sauvignon is famous for a lot of reasons. It makes wines that age for a long time, but actually there's a lot more Merlot than Cab planted. Yeah. And that is, because most red wine should be drunk, it shouldn't be drunk 25 years old, it should be drunk three or four years old. So this is a, a young, supple red grape variety that works actually very well as wine when it's young, okay? Yeah. And it's also, I guess with Cremel, this oh, is kind yeah. of what they're all about, aren't they, in terms of like taking those classic grape varieties and then seeing how they can work in Romania. So, Sanziana. Now, Merlot is normally served in a straight side bottle, actually. So it's unusual to see it in a bottle of shape. Now, um, Merlot, you know, Chilean Merlot was very popular for a while. Um, yeah, yeah. Very supple. We're in a very warm country. Merlot will It travels have... well, though, doesn't it? I mean, if one yeah. stands one of those great varieties. That... And, 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 and also, a lot of red whites are quite difficult to grow because they're quite dry and tannic. And this isn't. It's a soft, easy oh, variety. the fruit on that. It's just like, wow. I mean, you just open the bottle, that's just like... It's gushing. Like, it's, it's like... It smells like, it reminds me of... It also smells of like, like Turkish, like rose Turkish delight. It's like a oh, roses, wow. roses fragrance to it. It's got a lovely colour, it's not too dark. Um, mm. So Merlot, although it's a Bordeaux variety. It's like, so fruity, that one. Oh, that's lovely. And Merlot is, 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 is downtrodden quite a lot. And the reason is, because in America they grew a lot of it, they call it the Merlinoma, <laughs> the, the planting of thousands of acres of Merlot, which is a very ordinary grape variety if you don't treat it properly. But the world's most expensive wines from Pomerol in Bordeaux, like Chateau Petrus, Le Pain, they're thousands of pounds a bottle. They're 100% Merlot. Yeah, so Merlot can... Which is kind of weird why Merlot, kind of in soup circles, has a, allegedly a bad name. But I mean, this is kind of what Merlot yeah. has to say, what Cremel are all about. Like, they're about bringing great varieties, yeah, and seeing they, how they can do in Romania. And, and this, this is, is barely like, seven pounds a bottle. I mean, this is incredibly inexpensive wine. Uh, this is available in wine bars in London. I mean, like, seriously, then that would just like, with a lovely rich pasta sauce or, or a steak, or I don't know. What yeah, right? lovely, with a, just with a minute steak and fries, like steak and peppercorn sauce. Yeah. That's brilliant. Hi, Chief. I love that. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Happy days. Happy days, indeed.